Thank you. Crackdown has always been about innovation in open world gaming. And while we're set to deliver a massive new city for you to play in, it's the... Uh, sorry. It's the anything part of that vision where we're working to set a new bar. The in-engine gameplay and the technology that is the foundation for our game and the foundation for how we will change the way you play games forever. This is Crackdown 3. At E3 this year, Microsoft announced that Crackdown 3 had been delayed to 2017. Originally planned for a November 7th release date, Microsoft has announced that Crackdown 3 has been delayed until spring 2018. Again. Yeah, there are some troubling signs that Crackdown 3 might be getting pushed back yet again, this time possibly to 2019. Hi, hello, wake up, you, yeah, wake up, I said wake up! Microsoft is unwilling to delay this game any further, come hell or high water, whatever it is, it's coming out on February 22nd. Some people look out on the city and just see lights. I see lives, Agent, burning with hope for a better future. But what happens when evil comes out of the shadows? We do what we always do. We go to work. work agent you're going to be a force to be reckoned with in no time if you keep increasing your core skills like this Gates of light seen through your HUD are vehicle race markers, Agent. Complete these races to increase your driving skill. duty is tolerable, but in extreme, it undermines your progress as an agent. Denim 
government housing, mandatory employment, food of questionable origin. They've even got crappy bars and pawn shops. To... Down my arm! Unload, reload, repeat! They winged me! and carry objects of immense size and weight. Strength incarnate. You're packing dynamite in your fists. Oh! 
waits for no one, Agent. This is far from over. In fact, it's only just begun. Crackdown 3 will blow up the way you play games today by introducing a revolutionary new multiplayer experience using 100% destructible environments. Mother what you can do with a gun. It's the opportunities you can create with destruction. And this, by the way, goes all the way to the edge of the city, which is, which is as we extend the city, we just add more and more cloud compute to handle destruction right out to the edge of the vista. By connecting to the Microsoft Cloud, play with 20 times the computational power of your Xbox One and experience unrelenting destruction and mayhem. The building starts to go down and there it goes. And even when that comes down, it's so solid, so much mass, it will smash into the building next to it, take that one down, smash into the building again and start to damage the ones behind it. This wall is physical, so every single bullet actually takes away a little bit of the geometry. And I remove every part around the shape that I make in there. Then physically, that bit in the middle, you would absolutely expect to not be suspended in midair, but to fall out and be a physical shape by itself, like that. If we would have a massive building like this, a typical crackdown style building, it means we would have to be able to go into every single room in every single building. Every building would have to have space behind it and rooms inside it. Eventually, as we do enough damage to the base of this building here, that whole structure will physically come down. So there it goes. Once you've done enough destruction, we've destroyed the superstructure, the whole thing comes crashing down. It's all physical, it's all real time.
Now it's time to get to work. <laughs> time to step up your boom.